So, I've decided to bite the bullet. I've been, uh, thinking about this for a while, but I haven't gotten around to it. So, it's not traditional Sonic because I'm Knuckles. Because I find Knuckles just much easier to enjoy the game with and stuff like that. This is a side effect of the Sonic Mega Collection for the GameCube. So, not traditional Sonic, but who cares? Traditional Sonic also... Alright, so here's the biggest reason I've been dreading this. This, like Sonic 1, is a game that you can't save in. Despite the fact that save stuff existed back in the 90s. You know, Super Mario World figured it out and other such Nintendo games, but Sega was a bit late to the party. And this is blind for me, I've never done it before, and I thought about practicing it until I figured out it didn't have saves, and I was like, fuck it, if I have to suffer through it, I'd rather only do it one time instead of multiple times. But, I am hopeful that firstly the spring doesn't even fucking work, so I don't know what the point of it is. There it goes, you gotta push left, apparently. I'm hopeful that it's at least better than Sonic 1, and the majority of the reason I'm like, you know, I wanted to try this because I'm like, okay, well, I could play as Knuckles. I much prefer playing as Knuckles. That should make my life easier. That was also very rude placement. But I'm also just still nervous and terrified because knowing my history with Sonic, it's going to make me mad, so I don't really want to. And considering you can't save, that means I have to do this whole game in one sitting, which I think is fucking stupid. Another product of the era, even though technically that's not the truth, because... What? I was rolling into him as a ball, why did that hurt? Also, death counter, we'll uh, bring that back since you can probably... I don't understand this. I thought it was just a glitch, and I was like, oh, you know, maybe I somehow got out of ball, but it's like, no, the game's actually terrible, that's why you took damage. So. I didn't mean to jump at all. But yeah, we'll bring back the death counter, because I've got infinite lives on, because if you die, and you game over, like, that's just it. You restart the entire game all the way over again, and that's fucking shit as well. This game has, you know, missed out on some features that the rest of the world figured out. Let me fill up here and get these rings. My experience with Sonic prior to the... Why would it keep happening? Prior to the Sonic 1 LP has basically just been Sonic Advance, which, I mean, I enjoyed, I guess. Like, I played it a fair bit as a kid, but after that Sonic Advance LP, I was like, wow, this game's kind of, like, very rudely designed, where it's... Why do you keep doing that? Do the fucking ball! Like, that's a, that's a problem right there. That's becoming a huge problem real quick. But I realized within doing the Sonic Advance LP that the game's not shy about just springing you into danger and fucking you over. And that's becoming a pet peeve of mine that I kind of just associate with Sonic. But, uh... This first level is technically the only thing I have done as far as this game before, just, you know... to see how it works. And that's about it. So I've done this, but anything beyond this I have not done. I wanted to grab the ring, but I guess that's okay too. I almost died on the first boss. And I'm hopeful, because I also look at the levels and I'm like, oh great, there's fucking 50 million of them. But how long to beat says this game will take three hours. One sitting, three hours. I'm just hoping the levels go by quickly. That's basically it. All right, I wanted these coins, though. But, you know, this is a thing that everyone's played and experienced and everyone loves, so I'm like, I feel like I should do it as well, especially since I own the fucking thing. So, what was... Oh, okay. I was like, what was the point of that? Is going this way help since it wants to push me this way? No. Alright, we're not going that way either. And there goes all of our stuff. So did it want me to go up here and it was just being stupid? Like, that really is getting old super fast. Just avoid that. It's like, I don't understand what the point of putting that even there is. Like, what does that do? Other than just to troll you. 
games. That's basically what it seems like. And that's kind of the thing I was getting at. It's like, the games are designed to troll you. And I don't understand that. But, whatever. Get off the wall. I killed you and hurt myself. Whatever. In pipe. In, in the... There you go. Alright, let's go for a ride. Yeah, everything from here on out is blind. I know of chemical plants' existence and everyone's afraid of the water. Because that's just kind of like a, a trope. But that's all I know. And even though I'm playing as Knuckles in this game, I cannot punch. I only have a jump attack. That's it. I can jump and do nothing else. I can't punch. But being able to punch is a thing I like being able to do with Knuckles. But other words, I just get the ability to glide and that's about it. So. Alright, fuck you. Yet again, troll design. That's... Uh, always just throw you into danger. Yeah, because see, that was two minutes. Two minutes for one level. So if there's like 50 levels, I'm just hoping by it goes by quick. I really don't want to end up in a situation where, with like Sonic 1 where I end up getting screwed. That's basically it. Yeah, I saw that coming and said no. Oh, it made it up there. And I guess I'll repeat myself because I'd say other things. There are a lot of things about the Sonic games I like. Like, I think... Alright, I can't jump there, apparently. Like, I think they're very creative with, like, its stage concepts, worlds, like, chemical plant. Like, that's different. Very different. And I think a lot of the stuff they come up with is cool. The music's good. Almost all the time. It's just... frustrating. Up? Okay, up. So it's a case of, like, I don't want to or desire to be hateful and negative. It's just, I play the games and then I get frustrated and I'm like, oh, I don't understand. Alright, for instance, I don't understand why you don't do the ball thing. So where am I going? This way, then. Especially because when I see other people play, they do it so good and make it so easy, and it just confuses me why I'm the one, only one who seems to struggle. Probably because everyone that does it is like played Sonic forever, and I kind of haven't really. Oh, wow. Also, um, since I t mentioned Sonic Advance, uh, I did try Sonic Advance 2, and the levels are okay. What happened to the sound? The audio, but the the bosses are all absolute garbage and would not recommend or play. The music's back now. Okay, well, so much for that. If there was a lapse. Uh, I apologize. I was just about to check the capture. I just rewired everything because I was like, "Fuck this! This is a tangled mess." And um, not only was it a tangled mess, but I noticed the audio was only strongly coming out of the right channel and not so much the left get that extra life that we need so oh that's a pit there's no springs down there to save me okay how far back is this that's the, that's the extra life thing that we got so we're not that far back then. okay well how far can we go Not far enough. Alright, we made it to the second platform. We can go up now. Progress on. Oh! Cool, fun. Well, I can do this, sort of. That helped. Yeah, I know everyone's, like, afraid of the whole burp, 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 you know, the, the death 
sound effect music. Hold on, hold on, that's a spring. Do the dash, thank you. That did nothing, are you fucking kidding me? Am I even going the right way since that's pointing that way? Yeah, this. Well, not making this out in three seconds, two seconds. I lied, I made it. I actually didn't expect to make it. Why do you do this to me? Why do you do- What? What? Is that supposed to be obvious? Is that what I did a second ago? I don't like this. I mean, I guess at least I understand. Explain. Wait, 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 wait. Where? Why? He went through it before. Why isn't he doing it now? I feel like it's not. And yeah, because I hit a new checkpoint. I don't understand. All of a sudden, I could go through a wall. Now I can't go through a wall. Uh, yeah, that I don't understand anything that just happened. Am I ready to fight you? Yes. Okay. I wasn't sure if you were in the middle of I'm in vid school kind of thingy. Oh, I can tackle him like that. Okay, well that actually makes sense. I don't think I took damage. Another th actually, one thing I want to give praise to. Um, I like that when you hit checkpoints, it remembers how many rings you had. That's actually very courteous, because it gives you back the health that you had, instead of making you start from zero. So that's an improvement they got from Sonic 1. I'm trying to remember what other things that Sonic 1 did that I hated. And I feel like it's a little bit hard to compare, because um, cause I feel like you couldn't do this. 